<laughs> Hi, welcome back to Zoe's Plant Face Kitchen. Today we're going to be making garlic bok choy. Bok choy is a Chinese white cabbage that's very, very common in many Asian dishes. It's very fresh. This dish is going to be, of course, garlicky. It's really quick to make. It's a great addition to your dinner. So let's get started. First step to making this garlic bok choy is first you want to take some minced garlic. I have a lot here because I like a lot. And you're just going to put it into the pot. And then you're going to take something to stir around. And you just want to let the garlic brown a little bit. Just going to let that sizzle there. So now that your garlic is cooking, you want to take some bok choy. Right here I have some baby bok choy that I um, just broke apart, and you just want to put them into the pan, just like this. And you just want to let them cook, so you can cook off some of the water. Um, so now, to make the bok choy cook a little bit more, I'm just going to take a cover, and we're just going to put it right over the pan. While the bok choy is cooking with the cover on, you can take some peppers. I have some dried chilies right here. And take about two or three of them, like just like this, and just put them in the bok choy so they can simmer. Okay, so now when your bok choy starts looking like this, we're going to take the cover over and then we're going to add our last few ingredients. So I have a little bit of sesame oil right here. Gonna pour it over to give it a little more flavor. Then, lastly, I'm gonna take some soy sauce or amino acids, whatever you prefer, and then pour that over the bok choy. And you can put the cover on and just let it simmer for a little bit longer. Okay, so once your bok choy has simmered in the soy sauce and oil, it'll look like this, and it's ready to go and ready to be eaten. So here is your finished product of the garlic bok choy. Um, it looks super good. And thank you for watching Zoe's Plant Based Kitchen. Um, hope you enjoyed it. And I'm just gonna finish it right here because I can't wait to eat this.